Ukraine's air force expects that Russia will build up its number of combat UAVs. While there aren't as many missiles as last year, the matter is different with drones. It is not only about Shahid drones, whose production is increasing, but also about FPV drones. These drones are coming to them by the thousands, they are a dangerous weapon, and means of protection and countermeasures should be planned given that our enemy will build up precisely combat UAVs, Yuri Anat, the spokesperson of the Air Force of the Armed Forces of Ukraine, said this, Anat noted that Russia might resort to new tactics in the war in the future, in particular, in the coming winter period. The enemy uses military trickery. They will act brazenly, perhaps, with some new tactical techniques. These techniques change during the war. The Russians invent something new, the spokesperson said. But Russian troops continue to suffer from low morale. There are shortages of ammunition, and coordination between units has remained poor. A major factor still limiting Russia's capability has been its decision to keep its air force from forging deep into Ukraine after it suffered heavy losses in the war's initial stages. Its attempts to knock out Ukraine's air defenses have failed. Thanks to supplies of Western weaponry, Ukraine now poses an even more formidable challenge to Russian aircraft. Ukrainian military analyst Ola Jadonov notes that Moscow has maintained a numerical advantage in troops and weapons, despite any weaknesses, while Russia has increasingly tapped its Cold War arsenals, deploying tanks dating to the 1950s to replenish its massive, early losses, such old weapons can still perform well, Jadonov said.